on element vanish activity in uipath let's learn how to use that myself rakesh from uipath export channel please do subscribe and please do like the videos that you're watching on our channel with that note let's get started on element vanish so i have created a workflow and i'm going to run this workflow and demonstrate how this works for example let me run this on element vanish so i think the word is pretty much clear what we are expecting to see so now it has opened the portal okay so it is opening the work item portal and it is constantly checking if this particular ui element is still there only if it vanishes that's where it will act so let's say i am going to click on the home page so the moment i do this and try to move towards some different page so immediately it warns me you have moved away from work items please get back so and it is also noting the time of it okay so if i click on okay if i again go back so it is instructing me and it is logging a time if i go back once again once again it's going to do the same job so it is constantly monitoring so how do you enable or create such a workflow let's learn that okay so let me stop this and let's get started from the beginning so the very first thing what i'm going to do i am going to use a open browser activity quickly drag and drop that all right so once i have this all i have to do is copy paste the work items i want to be directly provide this work item link so let me copy this and in double quotes let me place this okay so once i have this all i want this to open in the chrome window i've selected that and the next thing what i want on element vanish so i'll be using this one okay and i'm going to indicate element inside a browser and going to indicate the specific work item let me do it once again okay so i'm going to indicate this and once that is done all you have to do go to the selector and here you see the name has not been added now to add this click on open in ui explorer okay and let the ui explorer window open up then we we need to tweak a little bit okay it has opened up now what i'm going to do i need the title of this okay so i've added the title i'm going to save it i'm going to click on okay on this window and i'm done now on element vanish on the right hand side if you see wait for ready repeat forever so i want it to be true because i want it to constantly check okay that's all and then here in this container because on element vanish is a container that enables you to perform one or multiple actions after a specified ui element vanishes so remember the meaning of the on element vanish activity so it is a container and it will act only when that ui element vanishes out of the screen okay so now what i'm going to do here i'm going to write let's say a message box and here i'm going to say i want to inform the user you have moved away from work items please get back and i'm going to write the date right so i'll give a plus sign and i will use system i will use system dot date time variable uh, method dot now and i am going to say in bracket and i'm going to say dot to string okay done so i'm done with all of this now let me quickly run this and demonstrate how it works okay let's see if it works or not all right so it will open the work items page done now if i click on home it should immediately warn me you have moved away from work items please get back and it has taken a note of my time also okay now let me go back okay it started again monitoring if i come out of it 
again it's warning me okay so that's all the workflow and there'll be a lot many intelligent work can be done using this activities guys okay this is just a sample example and i hope this might this must widen up your thought process and you can utilize it in much more smart way thank you guys for watching and please do not forget to hit on the like button please do do uh, hit on the like button and do subscribe to our channel thank you guys have a great day